Hi there from Asana. Today I'll show you how the Phoenix Corp's creative team uses Asana's AI Studio to streamline their content production process. Let's meet our key players, Alan from Marketing, who is requesting a new blog post. Charlie on the creative production team, who handles incoming requests. Yvette from the content team, who drafts new content. And Neha, also from Creative Production, who gives the final approval to publish content. Let's take a quick look at the Phoenix Corp's Creative Production workflow. At the top, we've included four workflow phases that are common across industries. The Creative Production workflow at Phoenix Corp's includes steps in all four phases. Without AI Studio, each step in this process required a human checkpoint, even when they aren't steps that require the strategy team members were hired to do. With AI Studio, we can see that AI can take care of a lot of the busy work, from renaming requests to translating content. But throughout the workflow, there are still crucial human checkpoints to respond appropriately to questions and make approvals. Here we are in the creative production project. Workflow stages are outlined by sections. There's a custom field for languages requested and a form the team uses for intake of creative requests. There are other options for intake via integrations like Slack or email. To submit his request, Alan fills out the form with details, including a description of his request, which is for a blog post on how No Meeting Wednesdays increase productivity, the target audience for the post, and his requested due date. After submitting, the request appears as a task in the project. Alan's form responses are included in the task for visibility and follow-up questions. The request is automatically renamed to follow the creative team's naming conventions and quickly moves to a quality check to ensure it's complete. It looks like Alan's request is missing some key information, so it's moved to more info needed. And now, an AI agent adds a comment asking clarifying questions about details missing in Alan's request. Alan receives a notification about this comment in his Asana inbox because he's a collaborator on the task. So far, Asana AI has handled three workflow steps that used to be huge pain points for Charlie's team. Renaming requests, checking for completeness, and asking for clarification. These steps used to take significant time and were done inconsistently. Asana AI just did them accurately in seconds. Alan quickly checks why the request failed the quality check. His request was missing details on languages needed, a requirement for form submissions. He responds in the comments with the needed information. Alan posting the comment sends the request back to the quality check to see if his comment clarified the missing information. After passing the quality check, the request moves to content creation, where an AI agent creates the initial blog post about No Meeting Wednesday based on Alan's requirements. Then, Yvette from the content team is looped in to review, edit, and approve the draft. This is an example of a human in the loop checkpoint, allowing the content team to still make strategic decisions about requests. After Yvette's approval, the request moves to translation, where another AI agent creates versions in each requested language. Finally, it's up to Neha, who oversees creative production, to approve the blog post for publishing. The blog post is ready for publishing around the world, and AI reports back to Alan to let him know his request has been approved. What used to be a time-consuming process with multiple handoffs is now an efficient workflow that effectively combines Asana AI with crucial human checkpoints. Let's take a quick peek into AI Studio to see how the creative team set up their automations. By clicking on the Customize menu and Rules with AI Studio, we can see all of the rules in this project. Smart rules are shown with the AI symbol. Let's click on the QA check. The AI Studio Rule Builder includes triggers, conditions, and actions, just like the standard Rule Builder. Choosing a trigger in AI Studio is the same, but now Asana AI can be applied in the conditions or the actions of a rule. For the QA check, AI is applied in the condition to check if newly submitted requests do or do not have enough information. 
Then, the creative production team gave instructions to Asana AI on how to assess requests for completeness. Notice this prompt is clear and concise, telling the AI agent its job and providing it with a framework to assess the requests. All of the smart rules in this workflow were built in a similar way, but Asana AI can be applied in different ways. In the translation rule, Asana AI is applied in the rules action. AI is being asked to create subtasks with translated content, and the instructions are specific to the task at hand, telling AI what its job is and how to format the translations. Today, we walked through a content production process, but these types of automation could streamline any creative workflow. Sound interesting? Talk to our team to identify ways Asana's AI Studio can transform your creative process or visit asana.com slash AI.